A split air conditioner has an indoor unit and an outdoor unit. As the name suggests, the indoor unit is placed inside the conditioned space. When cooling is desirable, the compressor runs, and low temperature, low pressure liquid refrigerant enters the evaporator coil of the indoor unit. As it flows through the coil, the refrigerant absorbs heat from the surrounding air. As a result, the refrigerant boils and turns into vapor. The air, however, is cooled down and thrown into the conditioned space by blower, running near the evaporator coil. The high temperature vapor refrigerant ejected by the evaporator coil, then flows to the compressor, located inside the outdoor unit. The refrigerant is then squeezed, between the two scrolls inside the scroll compressor. This increases the pressure and temperature of the refrigerant, and therefore, the refrigerant leaves the compressor as, high temperature, high pressure vapor. It then flows through the condenser coils, where heat absorbed by the refrigerant in evaporator and compressor is rejected, and it gets condensed to liquid. The cooling process is aided by circulating air through the condenser coils. The medium temperature, high pressure liquid refrigerant, then enters the thermal expansion valve. The valve decreases the pressure of the refrigerant. And finally, it leaves as low temperature, low pressure liquid. It then flows to the evaporator coil in the indoor unit, and the cycle starts again. This is how a split air conditioner performs cooling.